welcome to Alice Yummy Food. Today I have a special guest. It's my friend Alex from Birmingham. How's it going, everyone? And we're making an incredible dessert today. It's raspberry milfoy. It's oh. going to be lots of layers. It's going to be nice, very summery, and uh, hopefully you all enjoy it. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's going to be really fun cooking together and. This is a perfect dessert for any sort of occasion, if you've got someone's birthday coming up, or it's a romantic dinner, or anything really, isn't it? Yeah, get it done. <laughs> so yeah, let's get cooking. Let's go. For this recipe, we're gonna need fresh raspberries, milk, vanilla extract, eggs, flour, one roll of puff pastry, and caster sugar. Let's get the puff pastry. And yep. Roll it out on itself. Yeah, so we're rolling out the puff pastry first. We're gonna cut it into nice beautiful circles. Place them onto the grease proof. We're looking at about six that we'll need. The next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna prick our puff pastry. And why, why, is this, why do we need to do this anyway? We need to do this so it stops uh, rising too much because we want to keep it as flat as we can. And while we let holes in, remember, there's butter in between all these layers, so that means ah. the is gonna expand and the steam's gonna make it rise. Nice, nice. So you heard that guys. So basically, this is very important and it's quite fun to do as well. So, you know, uh, am I doing this right? You are. <laughs> Give it a good little poke. Let's poke it down. <laughs> but it Listen doesn't really to the matter. professional. Listen it just to needs the professional. to be, you know, doesn't matter if it's a little bit rough. As long as it's got holes in, we're all right. We can go there. <laughs> you know what I mean? So you can do this with your kids, you know, they can just help you out by poking yeah. the pastry. <laughs> Good, giving it a good old light like, poke, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're all right. And that's it, really. Once you've buttered and put some sugar onto your pastry, uh, we're going to cover it with another parchment paper. Uh, yep. With another sheet of parchment paper. And this is important, yeah, so they don't yeah, puff up again. Yeah, so it or... stops it from puffing. And then we're going to put a weight onto it now. Just like that. And when it when when they try and rise, we keep it quite flat because we want to build it as much as possible. All right. <laughs> cool. So guys, preheat your oven to 370 Fahrenheit or 165 um, Celsius, and we're gonna bake it for about 25 to 30 minutes. So while our puff pastry is cooking, we're going to be making our delicious cream. So. Separated our egg yolks. So we've got our five egg yolks in here. No, it's four. Four. Four <laughs> egg yolks in here. It's four guys, not five, <laughs> but you know. And then get our sugar as well, mix them together. And what we're going to do, we're going to cream it together. Now we're just going to fold it in. So this is going to thicken our pastry cream. Make sure we do it until it's all in now. Now add your milk into your saucepan. Add a tiny bit of vanilla extract. So once your milk reaches the boiling point. So we're gonna add it into the eggs. Only a little bit at the start. You just need to pour it out of the bowl. Place parchment paper on top of your cream and let it sit and cool down for about 20 minutes. So we're just going to lift that up really carefully. Once you put more sugar on top, we're going to bake it again for about 5 minutes to caramelize the sugar so it looks nice and brown and that beautiful golden color. And I've preheated my oven, turned it up a bit higher but 250 degrees Celsius or 465 Fahrenheit. Place your custard into your piping bag. You're going to pipe the pastry. So here it is. Look at this fantastic dessert. Doesn't it look amazing, doesn't it? Lovely, yeah. So easy to make, as you saw. We made it, what, how long did it take us? About 10 minutes. 
Okay, well, you know, with, with some chilling time, it'll take you a bit longer. But guys, it's 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 absolutely beautiful. Mmm. Mmm. Absolutely amazing. Bangalore. So good, guys. Mmm. And you can make this with strawberries as well, yeah. Yeah. Strawberries. Any sort of like summer fruit. Mmm. Smash it. Thank you so much for staying with us in the kitchen, guys. Give thumbs up for my friend Alex. Mm. Don't forget to subscribe <laughs> and share my video. And I'll see you next week. It ain't it's recording now. Oh. <laughs> Once you've cut your circles out, we are just gonna start. Um... <laughs> okay, one more thing. <laughs> we can learn Russian. Привет. 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 Sounds like a rap. You want to put them puffy pastry and not saying no, bro. Hello. <laughs> Once the milk has boiled, yeah. We have Borat in the kitchen. Yes, um, Borat. <laughs> Borat, come back. <laughs>